Bob Zaney was a cigar guy, but he was too young to be a cigar guy. Yes. <laughs> like, Bob, yeah, I understand. You're not there yet. <laughs> yes. You can be a Hawaiian shirt guy for a while longer and then go and ahead then and be a cigar it's guy. It's business, baby. Yeah. <laughs> I was like Bob, too. I always had fun with Bob on like the road. Bob. He's a funny guy. Uh, Another guy with funny in his bones. Right. Come on. Is he, what's his real name? Do you know? It's Believe it or not, Zanny. With, with two ends? With two, yeah. He just took out <laughs> one of the ends out. Is that true? I feel like you're funning me. I don't know. You're That's what funning I was me. I'm just giving you the information I was told. Jardo, you are funning me. <laughs> no. Not my name. Neither of my names. It's you. You're telling me. Yes. You won't answer to Jardo. No. Why would I? Because it's most of your name. <laughs> yeah, but then I would go. Well, it's Pardo, and then I would then I would, then I would hope that person would get mad and go. Right, it's you. Yeah, of course, Pardo. <gasps> it's Jimmy Pardo Jardo. Nobody would do that. <laughs> I'm doing it several times for humor. Am I? <laughs> or am I deadly serious, Jardo? <laughs> <laughs> I don't dislike Jardo to be honest with you. See, it the feels more, very Star Wars. The more you, it, it feels exactly. very Star Wars. Ikatu no. <laughs> Jardo. Oh, you used to people gonna joke. <laughs> uh, Jar Jar Binks, who was uh, named that? Uh, no, who, who, did, who did Jar Jar Binks name? That I said, uh, Issa Rae. Yeah, Issa Rae. Jar Jar Binks named her. <laughs> Issa Rae gonna be in show? <laughs> <laughs> that poor guy. That mm. that uh, fucking poor guy. Everyone was so he. Oh, best. He was so excited. This is the first fully CGI character. He yeah. gets to voice it and do the, you know, all the the uh, uh, the physicality and everything. Mm -hmm. And then people just fucking <laughs> hate him. They hated him. Hate him. Poor guy. He, he didn't. He, and he did a good job. He did a he good did a job. job. He didn't write the script. No. That was the problem. Yeah. Well, that was a problem. Hated. He got total script. <laughs> he's a rake on a show. <laughs> He's a nice guy. I'm the best. He was. I've heard he's a nice guy. Yeah. That's fantastic. And I he hosted him. the uh, the game show that Oliver was on. The oh uh, yeah the, yeah. The oh, he was on that Star Wars Temple or whatever it's called. Yeah, I wanted to see that Mary Mary Ho Mary Holland, very funny. Yeah. The, did voice the voice of, of the robot. She did. That's right. Mm -hmm. uh, Oliver and she had a reunion on this very show, and Mary was on. He was <gasps> excited to have because uh, they did not meet there. Right. He met the robot. She was like in a room with a microphone. Of course, yeah. somebody else was the robot, the moving robot. Yes, I don't. I think they could have just had her do both, don't you think? I don't know why. Yeah, why not? Split it up. Why not? I don't, she seems Mary I mean, Holland. I don't want to sit in a robot yeah, costume. I guess How much did the robot have to move? Not, I don't think it moved at all. Right? Like he just essentially did this, right? Yeah. What? Oh, you're very good at this. Thank you. Do uh, do Taft. At the, Taft. The, the, the Hall of uh, Presidents. Do him. <laughs> uh, let's see. You know what? I, I got a special bathtub built for me. <laughs> Love it. Give me, uh, give me, uh, give me Polk. <laughs> Boy. Did you ever hear that They Might Be Giant song about me? <laughs> <laughs> I got time for two more. Um, Matt, would you, do you have a request? I'm trying um, to go, I'm trying to go away from the usuals. Mainly because yeah. I can't remember any, I, I literally panicked. Let's they go. thought it was the only two presents. I could. Absolutely. Van Buren? Oh yeah, oh, Van Buren. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Do you recall when I was played by Anthony Hopkins? <laughs> I'm probably wrong, but <laughs> <laughs> wasn't that who was in Amistad? Why would they give you those words then, sir? <laughs> to make it uh, relatable. I understand, but if it, if it wasn't him. <laughs> this is Here's what you don't understand. They're trying to make the presidents more relatable in that exhibit. That's why they're all, all in right. sweats now. Oh, they're all in the uh, jacking suits? They're all in oh, sweats. that's nice. Yes. I'm glad they can be comfortable. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> they deserve it. Stand they worked day. hard. They yeah. served this country. Yeah. Uh, Barack Obama went from a full head of hair to gray balding. Mm -hmm. It's a tough Is job. Is he balding? Yeah, he's thinning. <laughs> he keeps a close crop, so you yeah, can't really tell you the really difference. Yeah, you really can't tell. He's playing games with you. Yeah. He's playing it's like Andre, games. It's like Andre Brower. You don't know if it's yeah, like what's his or gray deal? or what's happening. <laughs> what's his <laughs> deal? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot how long Patrick Stewart held on to the horseshoe. Mm. He had a little longer than you. Than yeah. you uh, it looked good, though. Do you know he, what I mean? He really made a, because like, he was considered sexy. And so he really, for, for like a brief period of time, men with that horseshoe hair could feel good about themselves mm. in a way that they never did before or since. Yeah, but everybody else was they like, were wrong, though. Mr. Hooper on <laughs> Mr. Sesame Hooper. Street, right? Did he have? Yeah. He kept it close cropped. He, and of he, course, it was it was like salt and pepper. It looked really good. But he has a great head. He's an attractive man. Mr. He's, Hooper? Yeah, Mr. Hooper. <laughs> Who are we talking about? <laughs> Shaft. Mr. Hooper's my hall pass. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. 
hear the whole conversation, subscribe for free on Apple Podcasts or wherever you get your podcasts, or visit nevernotfunny.com.